to shift on in the infield as that one is thrown behind, and they got him. There's that pop time. Rio Muto was aware of it. He fired down to Hoskins, and they caught Willie Adamas sleeping at first base. Take that secondary lead. You come back. You better respect the arm. Reese Hoskins waiting for Willie Adamas at first base. That one's hit well. Out toward left field. It is gone! A long two-run home run for JT. And the Phils are within one here in the bottom of the eighth inning. It's a 4-3 game for the life of the offense here. And that wasn't no cheapy either by JT. He just stayed through that ball so good. Nice high finish. There he goes. Slide step, swing and a miss. The throw to second from his knees, and he's out at second base. Wow. That's a heck of a tag by Stott, who might have gotten spiked on it. No argument from Wade. He got up and started headed back to the dugout. Oh, that's impressive right there. Wow. That's why he's the best catcher in baseball. Uh, Beltran. Ooh, there's a shattered bat. Bohm has it, flips one handed. Uh, with one hand, one hop over to first, off the glove of Hoskins. And Kim's going to go to second. He might even think about third. He's going to go. The throw by JT. He is out at third base. The fact that JT made this play will tell you everything you need to know about what type of catcher he is and how astute he is. He was busting it down the line behind the play, as most catchers should on the ball. It's a ground ball to the left side. He runs over there, grabs it. Picks it up, little hesitation, and he gets nailed at third base. There's two outs, and that's all that matters. Mm -hmm. Broken bat, yep. base hit into center field. Schwarber's going to score. Hoskins is around third, heading for home. The throw to the plate. He is out at home plate. Now let's see what happens here. I got to believe that Davey Martinez is going to get thrown out of the game here because there's the other school of thought that this was interference by the base runner, such that the Defender could not make the play. I don't know how they will rule this play. They'll probably go mm -mm. to New York on it. Mm -mm. When a one runner goes, Rio Muto, good throw. He got him. JT Rio Muto has now caught 14 of 30 would be base stealers as he guns down the runner at second. What a weapon. There goes Juan Soto, the pitch inside, throw by JT, he is out at second base. What a throw by Real Muto. It was a quick release, and he sizzled it out to second base. Just oh. a su supreme quickness on his release. I mean, he's a catcher back there. And that's the position he'd love to play if he wasn't being, a, if he wasn't a catcher. I talked to him about it. Just a great tag as well. Nice play, boys. Popped up. JT over near the dugout. And reaches oh, what a in play. and makes the catch. <laughs> a little tap <laughs> on the shoulder to Caleb Gotham. I think Caleb's head may have been down as that ball was coming over. Then as soon as they told me I was going to play first base, I can't. It. Get up, baby. Fly ball to deep right field. Going back is Thomas. Uh, it is JT. gone. Opposite field home run for JT. Number seven. And the Phillies lead it six to nothing. That's a pretty, uh, that's a pretty oppo swing right there by JT. He does go. He spun his wheels, swung on and missed. Throw to second base, and he is out at second base. And the JT is thrown out. Seventeenth base runner trying to steal this year. Strike him out. Throw out. Double play. He's not what anybody expected at the very beginning of the year. Runner goes, great jump, pitch missed down and in, excellent throw down. JT Real Muto is one of the best. Out to right field, that's well hit. Going back is Azokar, it is gone! Off the top of the wall, into the seats, a three run, opposite field home run for Real Muto. It's his first homer in June, and the Phillies are on top six to one. Well, that ERA just climbed up to over two now, Tom. 2.13. Wow. How about this six inning for the fighting Phils? That's what I'm talking about, T-Mac. JT was one of the many that were out taking extra batting practice today, working on the breaking ball, and doing a lot of that, hitting the ball the opposite way. Yep. 
Jason Camilli, the assistant hitting coach, we got done today, and I said, all curveballs today, huh? He goes, well, they're going to get a steady diet of them tonight. And he goes, we haven't done it in a while. He goes, watch out. Home leads off first, the 0-1. Fly ball, right center field. Robles, he froze for a moment. Now he's going back. It's carrying out of the yard. Wow. Into the Phillies bullpen. Well, how, how big has JT been uh, since post-Toronto series, huh? Mm -hmm. Pretty impressive. Hitting 385 since uh, that Toronto series. Including how well his team's playing, including his 50th win. And JT catches that one out of the air. It's a foul tip. Not a foul ball, a foul tip. How about that? Uh, it's a shame he's not athletic. I, it, you know, if he was athletic, he'd really be good. Oh, my God. And that one's there you go. Down get the center center. field. Senzel won't get it. It's going to go all the way to the... Wall. One is in. Here comes Alec Bohm. He's going to score. The ball gets away. Right. It's a two run triple for JT. That's a big time swing off the W.B. Mason side, or excuse me, State Farm side. Woo. They come in bunches, don't they, Bo? That's right. When he gets that foot down early enough, I mean, he is on everything. He's been swinging the bat real well. Smokes his ball in the left center. Runner goes, pitch up high, throw to second base. He is out at second base. 2-4 caught stealing. Well, you know, Brian Hayes can run. Above average runner, absolutely great pitch to throw on. A pitch up and into Chavis. Look, watch his pitch. Chavis has to get out of the way. It's an easy catch and throw for JT. And he just threw a dart down there to Jeans Jeans. Rudder goes, pitch outside, throw to second base. It's a seed, and he is out at second base. Why do they keep trying? I don't time? know. Why do they do that? 26th uh, person that he's thrown out trying to steal this year. 2 6 on the put out, no runs, one hit, two guys caught stealing, one from the pitcher's mound, the other one from behind home plate. So it's 1-1 one, one in the sixth. Now Real Muto, who has walked and grounded to third. Fly ball left center field. That's well hit, too. Blade going back toward the wall. It is gone! Back-to-back -back home runs. Harper and JT. And the Phillies have taken the lead. The hitter will let you know. Towering home run by Real Muto, his 17th of the season. The Phillies backstop goes out to the big part, big boy land. He had allowed just one hit before back-to-back -back home runs. That was kind of a hanger. It sure was, and that's what you do with him. You backspin him right on out of the ballpark. Out to right field, that's well hit. Going back on it is De La Cruz. It's over his head. It's out of the ballpark. It slipped right over the wall. A three-run opposite field home run. For JT Real Muto and the Phillies lead it six to one. Do the dang thing, JT. Maybe they should have taken your advice, partner. Just put them <laughs> on. Have a night. Four RBIs for JT. Fastball just he provided all the power. JT's going to just take what he gives them. Short swing, three-run homer. Mm. Right off the top of that short wall. If it was 10 feet to the left, it would have been a, an extra base hit for a, for a double. First multi-home run game of the, of the year for JT. Second one of his career. The count is 2-0 to JT. And a high fly ball to deep left field. Gonzalez going back. It is gone! It's a tie game! They're dancing around the base paths. JT Real Muto has just tied the game at three here in the top of the eighth inning. T Mac, it's exactly what he did. He he sat on one pitch in one spot and he got that hanging breaking ball. Brebia hangs this, spins this little slider up there, and JT did not miss it. Look at like hang up there, just ready to be stroked, and he crushes it to left. Huge base hit. Wow. That, that of, sounded loud. That's one of the biggest swings of the year, right there, folks. JT struck out in the first. Fly to center field. Harris on the move. Still going. Mike.
Michael Harris can't get there, and Rio Muto can run for days. JT on his way to third. He looks for it inside the Parker, and the catcher has won. Inside the park home run for JT Rio Muto, and the Phillies lead 4-1. Almost the easiest inside the park home run you're going to see in this bullpen game. Already going to be doing that a little bit. Rio Muto turns on a ball. Kiss it goodbye. Ten runs for the Phillies. Four home runs for the Phillies tonight, all coming from the top three in the lineup. Boy, the top three came here to play tonight. And a two strikes, a lot of damage has been done with two strikes. That typically pitchers have not made enough pitches to some good offense. Look, Philly had an offensive advantage coming into this series, and they're flexing some of that advantage right now. 3-2 from Garcia. Real Muto shoots one in the air the other way. Back goes Tucker at the wall. It's gone. Real Muto starts the 10th with a go-ahead shot. He tied it in the 5th. He gives him the lead in the 10th. And from down 5-0 to lead game 1-6-5. One nothing here in game five. Another three two pitch. And he runs again. A swing and a miss. Throw down. What a catching tag. Rio moves over the cannon. Bryson stopped the quick hands for the strike him out, throw him out. And this was a throw and run. So he's just going to make sure he goes home. And a great throw by JT. You nailed it right on the button. And you see where he blocks the bag. Well, you can't block the bag if you go in feet first. It's going to hurt a little more. But. You know what runners slide head first and which ones don't. That's a big moment here for the Philadelphia Phillies.